Hello, happy Wednesday, everybody. I am just reading some comments here, and Mimi T said that she appreciated the advice and wanted to thought it would be a good topic to talk about your hair care products that you use for this transition from color to dye free. You know what, Mimi T, you're right, it, it's good, and sometimes we need to just get back to basic. Back to basics because basic kind of gets a bad rap, you know, but it really is a basic essential foundation. My philosophy has always been a little bit is always less is more. So I brought my bag in here with all of my basic uh, hair care stuff. So I am kind of a, I usually go between shampoo and conditioner. I am a huge fan of the sexy hair. You can see these. Here we go. And I just do the pump. These, um, all of these products are right in the middle uh, price bracket. So you can get them, like these you can get at Target. And they're going to run you, d depending on where you are, anywhere from $25 to $35 for the two. The, a lot of times they come together. I typically would do the Bylage, and those run about $25 a bottle. They're a little bit bigger than this. And I kind of rotate. But if, um, if you want to kind of stay in a better price bracket, I think the Sexy Hair is great. And they have a healthy, it's, uh, this one is healthy. And uh, they have, it's, it's really good. I just, I dig it. Next thing I do is the Care Toss, the purple shampoo, which I am also, I don't know if that's going to come in. There we go, Care Toss. And this is the uh, purple shampoo. I am not an expert. Until I started doing all this stuff, I didn't even know that purple shampoo existed being a dark haired person. So I don't, I, there's a bunch of different ones. This is one I got, it's about $35, also in that middle bracket. And I mix it with my shampoo. And I don't do it very often. I only do it when I feel like my white is maybe a little dingy. I'm getting hot, whew, sorry. Um, or if I just need to kind of freshen it up a little bit like the gray. But if you do too much of this, it definitely will leave a purple tint, especially in the super light areas, like in your white areas. So you have to be really, really careful with that. But I, like I said, if I mix it in with the shampoo, I feel like it does a little bit better. It's not as strong and then I can, don't have to worry so much. But if you put it directly on the hair, you really do have to be mindful, not leave it on too long because it will leave a tint. So that... And then after I get out of the shower, my also go-to is it's a 10. Now this little bottle is 20 bucks. Again, you can get this at uh, Target. This one, Kiritas, I got it at, um, I think I got this one at Sephora, but it's pro you probably, you may not be able to get this at Target or something like that, but you will be able to get that at um, Sephora or at Ulta. This you can get at Target, you can get this at Walmart or, or whatever, but it, again, this tiny little bottle, depending on where you are, is going to be about 20 to 30 bucks, depending on. But I haven't found anything better. If you found something that's better, put it in the comments. But this is the kind of, you know, it kind of goes through everything. It's uh, adds shine, detangles, helps replace lost protein, seals and protects your hair, helps prevent split ends, um, helps with breakage, and it's also a flat iron spray and a thermal protector. So if you use a blow dryer or flat iron, you're definitely going to want to do something like this. And I mean, it's worth it. A little goes a long way. Like one bottle lasts several, several months. Ooh, I'm sweating. And so just to throw one in that a new thing that I'm totally obsessed with, boy, I'm sweating, is the... Hawaiian Tropic, this lotion, I'm t it's lime Kool-Aid and living in the desert where we get a lot of sun, it's really important to stay hydrated and something that's a little bit neutral as far as it's refreshing and clean smelling and it's, it's not uh, too fragrant either way. So, you know, it could be both, you know, fine for, you know, kids can use it, men can use it and you can use it. And it almost feels more like um, the smell of vacation than anything else. But I highly recommend this too. So anyway, I just thought I would just hop on here and do a quick video on my basic ass routine. And I hope you enjoyed it and i um, trying out my new camera. So we'll see how it all works out. You guys have a great rest of your week and I'll see you on Friday. Mwah.